A Las Vegas woman dies after friends and family say she was shot by her boyfriend. 8 News Now reporter Victoria Saha joins us from UMC. She spoke with the person who was there when 26-year-old Tabitha Tozzi was injured. Tabitha Tozzi was well known in the Las Vegas nightlife scene. But now the 26-year-old is the center of a different scene here at UMC as her organs are being donated. Friends and family are remembering her legacy of giving back. I can't imagine like living and going on without her. They were best friends, but more like sisters. If you met her, you saw light. Light that's now gone for those who loved Tabitha Tozzi. She got me out of my shell. She showed me how to use my voice. Tozzi's best friend doesn't want us to share her identity as she's still coming to terms with the tragedy. She was never the type of person to get vi violent or physical or let anyone be physical towards her. So I know like he, had, there was no domestic violence issue in the relationship at all. Her best friend says they were returning from a night out Saturday morning when a fight between Tozzi and her boyfriend escalated. She was trying to leave with her car and he wouldn't let her. The best friend tells us moments later, Tozzi's boyfriend approached her car, this time without Tozzi, telling her she needs to get out. I'm getting out because he has a gun in his hand. Fearing the worst, she runs to her best friend, finding her shot in the head. She was still gasping. She, she was still fighting. She still fought. She fought here. Tozzi's fight at the hospital ended Monday night. Now those who loved her are trying to figure out what life looks like without her. This is a guardian angel in real life, bro. Like, a real life guardian angel to everyone. Now, Tozzi most recently worked along Fremont Street. Uh, they say Tabitha was an integral part of the team, will never be forgotten. And Metro Police have not released a name of the person of interest, which is why we've not identified the boyfriend's name.